So the flag's going down, and away we go. Second gear here now for the climb up up mountain straight. 150 miles an hour on this straight before the breaking area. <laughs> That's pretty cool. What's the general speed limit? 60k. <coughs> oh. You can see there's houses all around the circuit. <coughs> People live here, it's a public road. because it's a negative camber when you come off it. Just about here that you can see the road falls the opposite way. Mm. And you can get really out of shape here if you're not on the ball. And if your car isn't set up properly, all the suspension balance. <coughs> Third gear up through here. Oh, I should have been a racing driver. Back down to second gear here. Still in second. <coughs> Oh, this is tight. Second gear here. But right over onto the wall there, using all the road. Pull third gear about here, just over that little hump. And then it's third gear all the way across the top of the mountain. Wow, look at the friggin' view. Flat out, flat out through here, third gear, <coughs> 130 miles an hour through these corners. Mm. Unbelievable the speed that you get across the top of this mountain. You wouldn't think the road had taken. Mm. This corner here is a real tricky one, it's, it's so fast, the car will just come up on two wheels. If you touch this ripple strip, as you exit the corner, right over to the right hand side of the road there onto that ripple strip, 130 miles an hour here, down to second gear here, oh my god, this is amazing, 100 mile an hour here, hard on the brakes now, Jesus second Christ. gear now, <laughs> this is called the dipper, God, I can imagine 50 mile an hour down through here. Shit. Accelerating real hard now into third gear now here, about 120 miles an hour to this apex. Wow. And back down to second gear here just before this right hander. Let the car flow out to the left and then pull it right across to the right. <clears throat> for a real tight, a real tight entry into this bottom corner leading onto Conrod Strait. And now oh. you're flat out. Why did this guy pull out? Yeah. Why did he? He didn't see God. you. God. Because I wanted you to just at least let it rip a little bit. <laughs> Coming up the straight. Just flat out down through here. Well, can't you slow down until he gets ahead of you a bit? I can't go fast. I, I, it's too risky. The cops patrol this quite a lot. to pull 170 mile an hour in me falcon down here. Unbelievable. Oh. Yeah, there's the sign. We're in trouble. 
<clears throat> back in my day when I raced here, <clears throat> the straight kept going all the way straight to that Armour Ore Bridge. It didn't take a right hand bend. Oh. There was no S bend in the straight. The straight was completely straight for one mile. Oh. <clears throat> Why did they put that in there? Because two people got killed. Oh. <clears throat> right. So that's the straight, but then it ends up with this really tight corner there. They call this a chase. It's really a chicane. It's not a fucking chase. They only give it a chase to give it a like a more attractive name, but it's a. So where's the finish line? Back where we started, and I'll show you. We, we haven't finished the lap oh, yet. Is that a hotel or something? Yes, it is. It's yeah. The oh. original bit. Yeah, that's the entry lane on the left side there that goes into the pits. When you're coming in to change your tyres and refuel, oh, yeah. you go down that that exit road there. And then if we turn left there, you're back onto the main straight where we started. Oh, okay. <coughs> on so the that, pit straight. So that would be the finish line that's, up there. That's the finish line up there. Okay, cool. That's it. You've done a lap of Mount Panorama. Well, that was pretty cool.